Hello viewers, this is Showman from Oil and Gas Field Quality Control. Today I think I am in the last video for the cathodic protection series. Uh, this video is for everybody but it is specifically for the people who want to make cathodic protection as their career. I have collected some information from internet and from my knowledge uh, so that I can give you some links and some details of uh, the courses, certification and institutes available to certify you as a cathodic protection specialist. So let us proceed. Cathodic protection as a career. How is it possible? It is actually specialization. Though used extensively, cathodic protection is highly specialized. To be successful, it requires a combination of the application of corrosion science, electrochemistry, electrical engineering, metallurgy, and often structural and mechanical engineering. There are effective standards, BSEN, British standards, and BSEN ISOs for a wide range of CP applications in different environments for different types of structures. They all have one thing in common. All make clear that CP design must be undertaken by CP specialist with a documented and appropriate level of competence. So from here the requirement generates. The standards make it clear that all work associated with cathodic protection such as design, installation, testing, commissioning, performance assessment and maintenance should be undertaken by personnel with appropriate training, experience and competence. So from here it is very clear there is enormous scope for this cathodic protection related engineers or certificate holders. Despite of rigorous nature of the standards surrounding cathodic protection, there are no graduate or postgraduate courses in cathodic protection engineering. Cathodic protection specialist may start with a science of engineering degree or via apprenticeships and trade skills. Then augment this specific training, experience and expertise. The Institute of Corrosion offers both courses and certification in cathodic protection. ICOR, this is one of the institute, it is Institute for Corrosion, in short it is ICOR, cathodic protection courses. Provide training required for level 1 to 3 for cathodic protection data collectors, technicians and senior technicians in the sector of buried, marine and steel in concrete cathodic protection. While providing the knowledge and skills training detailed in standard BSEN ISO 15257, the existing experience and tax competency are required depending on the course level. These courses are suitable for these seeking certification of competence in cathodic protection in accordance with ISO 15257 and also for managers and others who wish to have an introduction to cathodic protection so that they understand what their staff or contractors need to be able to do and the limits of what they should do within the scope of the standards. Independently of the cathodic protection courses, ICOR also operate an independent assessment of competence. The ICOR Professional Assessment Committee PAC, assess whether the applicant has the requisite level of experience, training, knowledge and tax skills as defined in BSEN ISO 15257. The certification is recognized and valid internationally. In the UK, almost all steel in concrete cathodic protection, those for Highways England, previously the Highways Agency, require cathodic protection personnel to be certified in accordance with ISO 15257. In addition, National Grid and the distribution companies and many marine, port, harbor and offshore operators also require certification of cathodic protection personnel. Cathodic protection companies will experience increasing benefits from having their employees certified in line with BSE and ISO 15257. They will be better trained, more competent and better aware of their responsibilities. Client and increasingly purchasing services from companies whose staffs are certified in cathodic protection. For independent contractors, certification will enhance their reputation, help them to work more if effectively and give greater access to employment opportunities. To learn more about a range of 
cathodic protection training courses and the experience and qualification needed for the certification you can please visit the icor website sustainability in the cathodic protection provision cathodic protection companies will experience increasing benefits from having their employees certified in line with bsc and iso 15000257 they will be better trained more competent and best aware of their responsibilities clients are increasingly purchasing services from companies whose staffs are certified in cathodic protection for independent contractors certification will enhance their reputation and help them to work more effectively now some references of courses on cathodic protection so this reference i got from the d welding institute this is famous for c sweep and bigas courses but also they have cathodic protection training assessment and certification scheme also their website and everything i am displaying in the video here you can go to their website for checking in details so their course introduction is cathodic protection is a method for protecting and controlling the corrosion on a metal surface underwater and beneath the ground by making it the cathode in an electrolytic cell this can be achieved either through the use of sacrificial anodes or by using iccp impressed current anodes i discussed about both of these galvanic and iccp cathodic protection is a very specialized field offering well paid careers in both off and on shore vacancies either though an employer or a self employed worker the interesting field of work provides genuine career progression and can result in employment opportunity to take you all around the world surveying pipelines and structures some questions uh, which are being frequently asked to this uh, twi do i need any qualification for this course no some of the course if you have an aptitude in physics and maths o level or gs or gcse for level 1 since you will study electricity and electrical units as a part of your course so this will be your basic qualifications you can do the courses how many days of training should i get in each level for level 1 you will get 3 days exam in on the day 4 for level 2 it is for 4 days training with examination on the day 5 for level 3 it is also 4 days training with the examination on day 5 once qualified what opportunities is available to me once you have qualified you will be able to take a job as a cathodic protection technician initially at level 1 and you would supervised by the level 2 employee what knowledge should i have as an protection engineer as cathodic protection engineer you will need to understand the influence of coating making it an ideal next steps if you have painting inspection on site coating inspection qualifications the c sweep certified course that will offer all aspects of the technology in three levels what standard is the course based on the courses are based on the european standard uh, en15257 which defines the competence level of personnel working in the field of cathodic protection this standard specified a framework of procedures for you to reach the required level of career so there are three courses in the welding institute um, conducting c sweep cathodic protection level 1 level 2 and level 3 what i will learn from the course this course will teach you the basics of corrosion terminology electrode potential reference cell polarization diagrams and electrolytes soil and water composition it will also cover methods of controlling corrosion principles of coating of buried and immersed structures sacrificial anode systems and impressed current system this course also offers typical designs of cp system cp material potential measurements and monitoring and maintenance what will i leave with this course will provide you a good understanding of basics cathodic protection including designs monitoring and maintenance and overall they will give you a certification what else should i know entry requirement candidate should have a practical background in electricity corrosion technology and engineering with a minimum of 1 year of relevant experience and must have a successfully completed an approved course of training in cathodic protection at the appropriate level 
Is it for me? This course is ideal for you as an engineer, technician or operator who requires knowledge of CP technician. What will I learn? In addition to the knowledge of level 1 engineer, the course will teach you the criteria of CP and their limitation. Uh, power Vex diagram interpretation, surface flame effects, polarization diagrams. You will also learn about CP design considerations for sacrificial anode and impressed current system, construction material specification and quality control, safety considerations, attenuation calculations, commissioning of CP system and potential measurements. Here I am giving you another reference course AMPP cathodic protection program. The link is also provided if you type this in Google it will give you the website. They have um, cathodic protection tester CP1 certification, cathodic protection technician CP2 certification, technologist CP3, cathodic protection specialist CP4. So the cathodic protection system are used as a critical component of corrosion mitigation across a wide array of industries and assets such as fixed offshore structures, oil and gas pipelines and storage tanks, ships and more. Our cathodic protection program is most specified in the world and provides students with the theoretical and practical fundamentals for testing, evaluating and designing both galvanizing and impressed current protection system. And who is the cathodic protection program for? This program is designed for field personnel, engineers, project managers, even for technical sales personnel. Numeric number of courses might be available, but um, this is to give you an idea what is the opportunity and how the course you need to do. Most of the courses are short term. So if you have um, interest and if you wish to do it, you please go ahead. If this video helps you, I will be grateful. If you like the way of my teaching, please don't forget to share and subscribe my channel and please hit the like button. Signing off and ending this series, Showman.